and welcome back again to my youtube channel so from my title you should know what we are discussing about please ignore this my <laughs> ignore ignore this my i'm just laughing like i'm doing i'm just laughing uncontrollably it's the good news you know i'm about to share and again guys please 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 before i share this good news please just do it to subscribe to my channel and also click the like button so that people that are pregnant with twins will benefit from this video so guys yeah the good news <laughs> first of all i want to thank god i want to really thank god because I have envisaged this. I really wanted to have, you know, twin. My friend had twins then. I was like, I tap into your blessing. And how do you conceive twin? How manage? How come? She was like, it came to her. She just had it. Uh, you know, it was natural. She did not do any other thing. I was just, I was just joking about it. I was like, I tap into it though. I really love twins. And at the same time, my husband was like, praying to god seriously this one he meant it and he wanted twins <laughs> i was like oh god your family doesn't have twin. your direct family doesn't have twin. my direct family doesn't have twin. so how come how manage won't get twin? so and finally finally god answered our prayer and guys i'm just i just want to give god the glory because he alone deserves my praise like i'm so grateful to god like i wanted to just I wanted to just be in the mood of worship, but I just, I don't want this video to be too long, so so that we don't get bored about the video because it is a congratulation video, guys. Please just be typing congratulations, congratulations. I want to congratulate um people that are having twins on this YouTube street. I want to congratulate the Jaram family neighbor yeah she has twins i also want to congratulate uh, melissa oti i want to congratulate lily pope tv i say congratulations to us we are having twins i'm also having twins guys so i am breaking the news to you guys that i've kept for so long that i could know who did like guys i'm so grateful to god <laughs> so i'm not a mother of twins like me how come like how manage so guys i'm going to do a video how what i did to conceive these twins but that video will come forth later yeah not now so fast forward to when i did um pregnancy test that was i did the just the home test the urine test the day after i was supposed to see my message i found that the test line was so red guys it was so so red i was like i went to the hospital I never knew I was having twins then. I was just like, oh, maybe it's a normal thing, or maybe my pregnancy hormone is high. So that's why the test line is so thick red. I went to the hospital after I have discovered that I'm pregnant. I and the doctor told me that I'm gonna do scan so that to test if to see if them to see there is heartbeat at all. So I went for scan and the sonographer was like wow 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 i said what is it wait what is it? what is it? what the wow 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 <laughs> i was full, my heart was beating she so said madam you're pregnant with twins because i don't even know why i did not even video the first sonographer scan i don't know why i did not video it but in all in all <laughs> we give god the glory so guys he was like ah, you are pregnant with twins so i was like I was happy. I was so happy. My mother was like, "Eh, how oh, cool? What? What?" But me, at the same time, I was like, "In this economy, <laughs> I was like, in this economy, hey, I was also, I wanted it. I, I actually, I wanted twins. Like, if you guys should not even misunderstand me, but I was, and I thought about the economy again at the same time with the way things, everything are expensive. I was like, well, God." God is infinite mercy. We, you know, when we reach the bridge, He will help us cross it. So you're like, he, like, he doesn't even know if it's triplets. Eh? I'm like, okay, be careful. <laughs> triplets. Let's just stop our twins there. Oh, yeah, triplets. Okay, okay, please search very well. There is no other one again. Okay? <laughs> so he was not like oh, your mother. You are having twins, and I was shocked. My husband was so happy. I was I was I was filled with joy guys I was filled with joy I was like I'm not a mother of three under three years so guys 
I just took a deep breath. I was just like imagining. I went home, I was imagining. I was just like, how come? How come? Like, oh, as in, I knew that I deserve it, but I was just like, I was just, I wasn't myself. So after that, um, I'm going to be telling you guys my first, second, and third trimester having twins. Guys, uh, you know, there are so many things you'll be hearing that it's not easy carrying twin. Like, it is not actually easy. It is not easy. My first trimester symptoms, guys. <laughs> Whew, my tiredness, tired, tired. Hey, guys, I was always tired. Like, I don't know. The tiredness was so, so much that I could not even lift up a pin. Like, I was having muscle weakness i could not do anything everything i was just so tired about everything i could not do anything i could not i was so tired the weakness was so much and again another symptom i had during that first trimester i was i wouldn't say in terms of vomiting my first child i was vomiting to as in i could not even put anything into my mouth but this one mm, i vomited not quite quite all right i vomited but it wasn't as severe as my first pregnancy. But that one I could do I could even even swallow something. I could even eat something and and be okay. Get I vomit like not regular, not constantly, ah, rushing to the bedroom or rushing to the toilet to go and vomit. And um, but I but at that time I could not even take my routine drugs. I wouldn't lie. What I was only taking was just folic acid. I see how the um, Ferrous, I still had calcium, I still had vitamin C, but I could not take any of those because I knew that okay, folic acid that one is very, very important because it avoids neural birth defects. So I was concerned with that one. At least that one is tiny and it's just once a day, it's just small. <sighs> Guys, <laughs> that first trimester, a lot of things happened, and again, another symptom that I had was I, could, I was not even having. I was not having the energy to talk. See, at the time when I'm even walking on the road, I can, I see they, they, no people will not even understand. I, I don't want to even talk to anybody because I don't have the strength. But people will not even understand. I just want to pass my own and just be myself. I'm not, I'm not talking to anybody. But people will not understand at that point because your tummy is not showing then. And another symptom that I noticed that I could not even cook and eat. Like I don't like my food. Rara, I, even to cook, so I cannot. I, I could not even cook. Now talk more of cooking and you know having that urge to eat. I could not. I love people's food. <laughs> people's food is my best friend. Like even though the food is not sweet, let me just just give it to me. As far as it's coming from outside, I don't want to see how it's been made. But as far as it's coming from outside, I'm fine. I'm going to show you a picture of my twin this can results so guys this is the this is the scan i said let me show you guys look at it this is it <laughs> so i just want to take my thumbnail guys this is it i'm so happy so okay so that is what happened during my first trimester i could not i was vomiting but it was not really as severe because people were like and hey, when you have twins you're going to be vomiting you're going to be vomiting severely but it wasn't like that for me in my own case I was vomiting like i was vomiting guys but it's not too 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 severe so at least i had i was kind of i had a, i had advantage in that another symptom i had in my first trimester was cramp guys the cramp was i was having cramps the cramps was too much and i was always complaining i go to the hospital to check if there's any issue but doctor said it's normal so that was one thing i I observed the cramp. Oh, the cramp was something else. I was like, what? But as I was approaching second trimester, I, you know, it it went away. So, guys, my second trimester was just like a walkover. I was so energetic. I could do things. I was so happy. I was like, ah, yes, I'm now back. I could do anything. I could go to market. I was so strong. I would clean did this out. Give me work I want to do. I want. <laughs> Guys, I was so energetic. I was so energetic in my second trimester. So fast forward to third trimester. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, guys. Hey, third trimester is where 
first and second trimester and those periods that oh i'll be like i'm not be remembering god oh i never knew pregnancies like this so i've forgotten so soon no 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 <laughs> guys third trimester was something else for me i ah symptoms i was having in my third trimester was weakness also weakness came back i could not do anything i was just you know i was just there but my husband had been so 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 supportive like that man had been so supportive because right now i don't have someone to stay with me i don't have a help so we do everything ourselves me and my husband we manage to do everything ourselves and manage also my toddler <clears throat> so guys see those those the way i'm just i don't really have much energy but you know i just have to make this video you know easy i'm already like uh, i'm tired like this guys i was having pelvic pain pelvic pain like oh at this point the twin baby's head uh the twin baby's head are head down the two of them and guys <laughs> i was just the pain here i just having pelvic like pelvic pain if i'm walking it's as if they are pushing me you know that's if they are pushing me it wasn't easy i could not even walk well <laughs> i could not walk well i'm like hey Hey, who sent me away? <laughs> it was not really, really easy, guys. Eh? I was having pains in my lower abdomen. I'm not gonna lie, the pain was too much. I was, I'm having um, also Braxton Hicks um, contraction, guys. The contraction when it comes like this is actually a false kind of a false um, labor. That's what it's being called. Like when it comes. The pains, the cramps, you know, the children now are now developing more strong bones. They can now, you know, stretch, they can feel the environment in the tummy. So it comes with kind of um, not really a severe pain, small pain. And guys, it's in short, I don't know. There are some people that, you know, get pregnant for nine months and you see that woman throwing the baby away. And I'm like, with all the sufferness, with all the stress you have passed through, the um, stress of sleepless nights, this is my third trimester. I hardly sleep. Like, see, huh, the sleepless nights will be here. I, I cannot even sleep there because I'm not comfortable. So you, you know, you can't even lie with your tummy. You just, uh, is it that you lie left or right? And at the point, you see, some people will tell you, you know, it's not even good to lie for too long with your right side so most uh, most of the time i lie with my left side and it can be so tiring so with that sleepless night you're not comfortable sleeping with the pelvic pain with the contraction boo -boo -ti -boo, with the weakness you know you'll be feeling so uncomfortable and weak and i'll now see a woman throw her child away and i'll be like see no matter what even though it's gary even though you it's better you beg it's better you go out there to beg with your child or you go and give a good motherless baby home that can take care, good care of that child instead of throwing that child away but seriously with all this <laughs> i don't know i don't with all these struggles that i've passed through of nine months and that woman oh no 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 i just i i don't know why so women are like that but nevertheless this third trimester <laughs> it's not easy guys i've not been finding it very easy even to upload videos i find it very difficult seriously i find it very very difficult and what else again in this third yes <laughs> my skin color guys see i can you just see the way i'm very ugly <laughs> see my face has changed like i, I now look like Pregnancy has done justice to me. <laughs> God, I can't even, I can't even imagine, like, I can't even remember my real face anymore. Like, my skin color has changed. Huh? Anyone? Is this me? <laughs> but nevertheless, we thank God. So, guys, that's just it. And again, I notice actually mood swing when I'm stressed with my toddler. That one is normal. Mood swing in pregnancy is normal. You just be having mood swing. 
<laughs> even when at times you just be feeling emotional for no just cause like something that you overlook when you're not pregnant a little, every little thing you are crying you are mm, this person did this to me yeah <laughs> it's so emotional uh you know you just be so emotional you know other things are normal most things is normal in pregnancy there are some people that don't have mood swing though it's just the, it just depends on individual so guys thank you for watching i just came to share this good news to you people my youtube family that i'm pregnant with twins so yeah so just stay tuned to this channel there's so many things i want to you know carry you guys along with twin multiple you know babies you know sometimes when i check the internet i don't really see much about it i don't know why people don't really share information like that yeah so this is just it this is my life with my toddler and my twin i'm currently carrying a twin pregnancy you guys can see how my tummy is so big guys my tummy is so big at this point in time <laughs> see as with the work self don't bless in a breeze the push-ups because I, to work out now eh, in our wahala but in all we thank god because god he see he knows why he gave it to me he knows that he will be there for us actually so i really want to thank god again because he gave it to me he blessed me with you know my heart desire yeah and for those who are looking for this special gift like you guys are not exempted please and please continue being steadfast because i know that one day one day god will knock at your door and say take take this multiple take this triplet take this quadruplet that it is for you take this strength it's coming your way just hope and just try as much as possible to you know visit the hospital try as much as possible to do some medicals you and your husband your partner just try as much as possible definitely god will answer you god will definitely answer your prayers so and as much as for those that are looking for this same um same joy i prophesy today that you guys are gonna have it i'm not a pastor but i pray that you guys will have this special gift so thank you for watching if you do well to subscribe to this channel because more 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 interesting videos are coming your way do well to like do well to comment your thoughts do well to congratulate me in the comment section you know hit the notification bell most especially so that anytime i upload a video you will get it yeah so thank you and see you in my next video bye